Hi again, reception. So today's video is all about weighing things because this week in class we're thinking about objects which are either heavier than something or lighter than something. Now in class we're going to be using a balance scale but I know at home you might not have a set of balance scales to use. So I'm going to talk you through an alternative way to do it at home um, towards the end of the video. But for the moment, I'm just going to show you how balance scales work. Now, can you see at the moment I've got what's called a balance? I know I've got a balance because my balance scales are even. Can you see both sides are pretty much at the same level? Now the first thing I'm going to put into my balance scales is a really small cupcake. I might eat that afterwards. Now what do you think is going to happen to the balance scales when I put the small cupcake in? Have a little guess. Right, let's see. So can you see what's happened to the balance scales? Maybe tell your adult which you're with at the moment. Can you see, because the cake is heavy, it's caused the balance scales to tip. Now the heaviest side will always tip down. Right then, I'm just going to take out that cake a second and put it there. Now, I'm going to put another cake which is pretty much the same. Can you see I've got two cakes which are exactly the same. Now what do you think is going to happen when I put two cakes into the balance scale which are exactly the same? Let's find out. I'm going to put one cake in that side and one cake in the other side. Now can you see that arrow is almost exactly in the middle. It's trying to, it's just, just evening itself out. That little wobble starting to disappear. And can you see that the balance scales is level? Now why is the balance scale level at the moment? It's level because both of the cakes are the same, same weight. Now, Let's keep the cake, and this time I want you to try and predict what's going to happen next. I'm going to put in the cake in that side, and I'm just going to put in a, a pencil, a bit like the pencils that we use in class. Which side is going to be the heaviest? Will it be the cake, or will it be the pencil? Pencil goes in, cake goes in. Oh, what have you noticed? Which side has the balance scale tipped towards? And what does it show? Now it hopefully shows that the cake is heavier than the pencil. Let's try something else. I'm going to keep my cake in for the moment. I'm going to put in some scissors. Let's see what happens. Oh, oh, it's almost, they're almost the same as each other. Just give it a chance to settle. And they're almost the same weight. So at the moment it suggests that the cake and the scissors weigh the same amount. Right, I'm going to take these two objects out and I'm going to come back in the next video with a couple more objects and to give you an alternative way to do this at home.